a new meaning to the idea of a blank canvas. You've heard that a picture is worth a thousand words, but what if you've never seen a picture before? I'm Alberto Camargo in the College Town neighborhood where artificial intelligence isn't just being used for science, it's creating visual art from the lives and stories of the visually impaired. You may not know what it's like to be blind. This eye is completely blind. I've had multiple surgeries. This eye, I have a teeny tiny tunnel of vision. But you probably know the feeling of achieving something you didn't think you could. Thanks to the powers of AI and of our memories, the Blind Can Film Festival is turning the impossible into reality. Founder Ben Fox says all it takes is a conversation. If we bring in a person that's blind and they're telling their story to the AI, to all of us, and the AI is able to spit out, I don't know, five images from that one hour interview, they are that person's images from their mind that they wanted to share. This image came from the mind of Wayne Piercy, an intern of Ben's who studies jazz at Florida State University. Wayne was telling the story when his dad bought him his first trumpet. I wouldn't have, definitely wouldn't have uh, thought that, that, that this is, you know, anything that I would have been able to interact with. The AI is simply a tool. The brilliance comes from within. I literally never thought that was possible. So, I'm just trying not to cry too much anymore. I really just, <laughs> I never thought it was possible. Still not a believer? See it for yourself. The Blind Can Film Festival will host screenings of its films at the Challenger Learning Center on January 23rd and an exhibit at the Florida Capitol on the 24th. In College Town, I'm Alberto Camargo, ABC 27.